So one of my favorite days is happening, um, a readathon. And I'm really excited to have a readathon. Um, the fall is the perfect time for that. But the weather's changing, it's nice and cozy. I'm ready to curl up with a book. So um, one of my favorite readathons to do is the Dewey's readathon. And this one <laughs> goes from uh, 7 a.m. Saturday, well, sorry, 8 a.m. Eastern time Saturday and goes for 24 hours. So um, I have stacks of books here ready. Um, my Kindle's ready. Always it's ready. And I have some audiobooks. My plan is to wake up, you know, and start reading. I'm going to try not to sleep in too much but I might enjoy that. I might embrace it because it's been conference week with um, parents and also it's Saturday morning, so sleeping in. But once I wake up, I'm gonna start reading and just continue that for my day. I'm gonna try, my goal is every time I pick up my phone, if it's to play a game or go on social media, either I'm posting about the readathon and it's a quick post, or I'm gonna put down my phone and read, okay? Um, I do have a wedding to go to in the afternoon, so I'm going to listen to an audiobook on the way and then just read as much as I can um, <clears throat> when I'm not there. And then um, that night I'll stay up and read, I'll probably stay up as late as I can. And then, um, you know, in the past I've set timers to wake up early. I don't know. This one, I like this readathon. Um, because it starts early in the morning, the ones that start at like 8 p.m. are really hard for me um, because I miss so much while I'm asleep. So I think I'll be more successful on this one starting in the morning. Um, my main goal is to finish books that I have going. So I feel like I have a lot of books currently reading. I like to read a lot of different books. I always have like 10 going on at once. So the audio book I'm listening to is City of Girls. Um, and when I finished that one, I went to read um, Monsters Born and Made. Um, sorry, I have the hard copy over there. I don't think I'll get to that, but that's my plan for audiobooks. And then I have three, I have four minutes left of The Ghoul of Windy Down Vale. Finishing that, um, I am two thirds of the way through Ichiro. Um, and so I'm going to finish this graphic novel and I'm also about a third of the way through Almost American Girl, another graphic novel. So I'm going to finish the two graphic novels um, and then I am so close to finishing the X-Hex. So I'll finish this and then um, I took a break from Keeper of the Lost Cities because I wanted to read um, more Halloween themed. So I will, you know, honestly, this book goes really fast. So I hope to either finish this or make a pretty good dent. So that is my plan. Um, I do also have a lot of picture books that I need to review and read. And I also have a lot more comic books. I have the first three books in the Space Boy series. I have um, yeah, a couple other random comic books so those I always like to use comic books when I need kind of a pick-me-up um, with my reading or I'm starting to get tired or you know um, if I'm hitting a slump of some kind so those are my goals um, I will try to post tomorrow um, at some point but follow me on my Instagram at Mrs. Book Dragon and Twitter to see most of the updates and then I'll let you know how I end up doing so Read a thun. Let's go.